Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. This is exciting. So I'm sitting in the back of my car and come here. This lovely person got me the Union Jack tail lights for the Mini yes, for Christmas. So today we're going to be installing them. Yes, we are. And I'm very excited. Are you going to do it? I want to help. Okay. I want to try and do most of it, maybe. Okay. Yes. You can do the coding bit. Uh, I don't know about that, but I can help with the installing. Show your lights. Okay. Oh. So this is the current ones that are on here, and they just... Is this what's standard, babe? Are they like these are standard. standard ones? So these are the standard ones that came on the car, and then... Where are they? These are... Can you open up? These are the Union Jack ones that we are going to put on the car. So, I'm very excited. Can you guess what to do first? Um, well, you already popped that oh, thing out. <laughs> so I'm guessing that's what happens first. Well, yeah. And we then we have to do it. We have to the disconnect lights. these lights. Yes. Disconnect this from, from here. But which one is it? Which one is it, though? I don't know. How do I, I haven't looked Ow. yet. This is going well, isn't it? <laughs> hey, it says BMW right here. Well, it is a Mini. I know. But I don't want to... Oh. There's a bit that's got like a pin thing. Can I just unplug it? See what happens? If it's for the lights. If it goes into the lights. It goes towards the lights. Then it's probably for the lights. Okay. Pull it out and find out. <laughs> oh. You got it? Yeah. Well, that was really easy. It's this is it one. just... Oh. It just pulled out like that. These bloody modern cars and their small connectors. Um, now I don't know what else to do. Well, we need to get the light out. So usually it's screwed in or bolted in. What do I have to do with this now? I don't know this? what that's for. I don't know what that's holding in. I don't think that's doing it. I think it's just holding that rubber part in to stop uh, metal hitting metal. Okay. But there's probably screws probably. back there. Probably. I think I need to look with a flashlight. So we just watched a video and you have to take the trim off around the lights to get to the screws underneath it. You can probably easier to use pry tools, but probably. Uh, I got that one off without. Yeah, he's already gotten this one off. So these are the screws that are underneath it and how to get the lights off. Oh. <laughs> I know. Do you want to get a plastic spatula? Yeah. Okay. Or, oh wait, or, no nope. mind. Once, like, you get that bit. Yeah, it's pretty easy then. Don't want to snap it. There you go. Cool. So then we just have to take. <laughs> yes. Then we just have to take all the screws off. So for some reason we're having issues with this top screw here when you use the Union Jack lights. It doesn't, there's, there's still a gap here, so it's not pulling it in all the way, but it gets really, really tight. Whereas we tried the same thing on the standard light and it works just fine. So that's what we're trying to figure out right now. So we just put this one in, this is the other Union Jack light, and screwed in at the top. And it fits in perfectly, like it's exactly how it's supposed to be. So. That is so confusing. Why does that one not work and this one does? We'll find out. Find out in a minute. Okay, so we managed to figure it out. The screw had been threaded wrong? Yes. Is that right? We had got the wrong angle. Yeah, so. So we forced it a little bit, 
but luckily there was enough for it to pick back up. So that one's all finished now. Yeah. And then we're just going to do the other side. Which we just have to screw them in. Can I screw them in? Yeah. They look so cool. Yeah, they're on. They're flickering, yeah. Cool. Yay! Oh, I love them. They look so good. I love them. I think they're so cool. I want to take the car out later when it's dark and turn it on then and see and see how they are. But yeah. Yes, we have to code them, but we're all done. And yay! I love them. It looks so nice. Like. They look really, really good on it. Okay guys, so to finish off this video real quick, I'm gonna show you what the lights look like outside in the dark. I think they look so good. I love them. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please be sure to give a big thumbs up if you did. Let me know in the comments what you think of the lights. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you go ahead and do that. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.